top of the morning everyone out there in the blogosphere is coffee tapping back in man and uh actually mid-afternoon man stay off the sauce and all that everyone stay sober that's the key right but peep it man we got um milk seven four chiming in dj academics is mentioning them Comment what y'all think been going on with milk, man. Everyone's on this. There's this big rampant debate if milk is homeless or not, and why ain't he been making content? And is he is he out on Skid Row? And I don't know. I think I think milk trolling, man, because this ain't the first time there's been a narrative like wifey put put him out the crib. But um, let's check this out. Here's the thing with the West Coast. Like podcasters, and now you see this is this excludes TRL and of course um, AD and anybody from like you know Thing Community, um, mm-hmm. because th- I know them because I've watched them as personalities do shit. But for the most part, a lot of times, like there's this one guy, and I think he gets mentioned sometimes. His name's like Milk something. I'll click on his videos, and I'm, I'm usually watching what I'm eating. Sometimes y'all are so West Coast, bro. Y'all are talking about shit that I have no idea about. It feels like another world. You feel what I'm saying? And then anytime y'all get into like politics shit, and I honestly believe this is the majority of non-West Coast people, we're clueless. Like we have zero idea. So I always say, I don't think sometimes y'all making content to appeal to people like me or people who are not from the West or affiliated. Hey, I'm gonna let you know. I'm gonna say us as a whole, we don't, we really don't be covering like street politics and stuff like that. Like we don't do that. I mean, we we, like if anything, like we make content, we probably bicker amongst each other and shit like that. That's why I watch you. That's what I'm saying. We're covering like real hip hop shit. All right, listen. listen. I I don't know what I don't know what Keem covers a lot, but that's and I could be wrong on it. That's what I think of most LA podcasters. Even even now, and I I know these your ops, uh, no jumper, like. Apparently, this guy is really popping in L.A. They were talking about some guy. His name is, like, Big Sad. The first time I heard about it was on No Jumper. And here's the thing with the West Coast. All right, so y'all see that is labeled DJ Academics laughs after schoolboy Q manager tells him Milk is homeless. The clip didn't even pick up that part, man. Sometimes these clips, man, whole narratives and ish can start up behind, um, you know what I'm saying, can start up behind ish and i'm sure he did say that though they just whoever whoever threw this uh threw this up didn't didn't get that part but again i want to know what everyone thinks about milk being homeless so that was ad on there i heard and and uh, i guess apparently was it schoolboy q manager as well you know what i mean i know with smack and all that and you know their rapport with him they're tied in with td in that way or whatever and schoolboy Q, which I wonder if they were speaking about that at all. That whole Drake situation, y'all seen that? Schoolboy Q in the in the Kendrick video, and then he's getting uh, letters from the police in Toronto about his show being canceled. That's crazy, man. What does everyone think about that, man? Is is Drake tapped in with the Toronto PD, or was that some politics behind? Because there was something else about Drake owning a club out there, but um. I don't know, yeah, whoever whoever got that clip, but whatever, um, Milk, what did Milk say about this? Ack mentions me while discussing West Coast podcasters and schoolboy Q's manager, Keem, uh, turns around and tells him I'm homeless. Seems jealous that he been knew who I was, but, but didn't know you. Okay, so, um, yo, listen, Milk is one of those dudes, man love him or hate him people do know him you know what i'm saying and he definitely built the platform from the ground up and i I was saying that in another video right about how people are saying this this homeless narrative like i was saying there was a narrative before like a lot of people like hate watch milk a lot of people watch milk for the comedy elements the names he be giving people like i was saying before like nina butter and what help help me with some some of the other ones like brick baby uh setting nash you call him celery nash like you know what i'm saying milk got his own brand of humor and stuff like that you know he got them jokes and um he'll go where a lot of people won't go as well he ain't afraid to put some bull ish out there into the blogosphere but like a year or so ago when milk was um there was a period like this where he was gone for a grip like he wasn't making content like that y'all remember that and they were like yo milk got in a fight with his 
with his girl and yo she hit him with a five piece and a biscuit and then and then she put him in the county and he caught a dv case and then it was all cap it wasn't even true you know what i mean and early on when milk i think i don't know but i think he used to be on his breaks we're talking about under six thousand subscriber um you know milk seven four where like he, he I, I believe he would be at work and he'd hop out on a break and like be chilling in the cut people would be like yo look at this man he's homeless you know what i mean he was just on the grind doing whatever he could to get some content up and, and get that face time and people to know him more you know what i mean because a lot of us we seen him first seen him on that interview with big herc but um yeah like i guess milk got a great point there keem tde people better know who milk is um but not but not him and what do you guys think about what Axe said too that some of the ish be so west coast it's like does it appeal to everyone that's another good thing i think that milk does that maybe other individuals from from out west don't do as well well where the way that they keep it with the lingo and what they're talking about is only more hitting on a west coast level milk will bust it down and you know uh send it out via the whole blogosphere where everyone will tap into it he'll kind of he'll kind of simplify it in a way for for other people that don't understand all them politics and ish uh, let's see he knew him from years back my guy he blocked him in 2018 the video review guy no one from the west coast takes this white guy serious says a fake profile milk said wow how would they how they would laugh at a guy for being homeless whether true or not cuz off no jumper cuz of no jumper so this guy's saying people only know him cuz he was on no jumper get a job oh yeah milk something the bomb so that's another thing too i see milk back beefing with no jumper that's the thing i think that it uh flucked up a lot of people when milk went back over there you know what i mean um i think he did it for the cash flow cuz you heard him they were talking about that he would pull back up and do more content and i don't know but that's my whole theory on it that milk was having some issues with the yt system the ut system right the way they break down that that revenue something was going on and um you know what i'm saying when you become accustomed to a certain type of bag coming and then it stops it's like damn you know so maybe he felt that was the time to go back on no jumper and and do more content but did it, it didn't happen that way it was a one and done and now he's back beefing with him but comment and let me know what you guys think about this and if you think he's really homeless or not in other news though how about this we will not have men playing in women's sports that will end immediately from trump um, and then Biden officially dropping out of the presidential race. Listen, there's no way. Um, and I want to know if everyone agrees with this as well and what you think about the race and all that, the, the, all this election season drama. There is no way that um, Trump does not win. And y'all know that watch this channel. I'm not a Trump guy. I'm not against Trump. I'm not into all that political ish. Trump's winning. It's just what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like whether he just got grazed uh, or whatever, he's winning. The, the way, like I always, this is a prime example how I always talk about it's all about the momentum, right? It's all about momentum. Good momentum, bad momentum. If you got that momentum, how do you keep it pushing? And how do you capitalize? The way they did that conference and just the way everything's been going, man, it's, it's a wrap. Trump will be uh, back in office. And then that other ish going on with the sentencing being postponed in the uh, presidential immunity. You know what I mean? I guess I'm thinking that will dead out that other situation with uh, with that court case. But don't he still have a Fed case if he gets in office? Will that be deaded as well? I don't know, man. But there y'all have it, man. It's milk homeless. Uh, DJ Academics talking about with um, Keem and AD about milk, um, what what's going on with it all and, and all the election season drama. Let's talk in the comments. Subscribe. Thanks for watching. It's Coffee Talking Music News Sports. More. I'm out of here, y'all. Peace.